Greetings, new fish. I'm Captain Quark. I I don't believe it. You're here. I used to dream of being arrested by you. Now get out of here. I was talking to you, Zed. Yes, Captain. So, new fish, I take it you followed my many, many adventures? Of course I have. You're the most famous superhero in the galaxy. He ain't famous anymore. <laughs> Words hurt, solitary Bill. I'm a huge fan. I even pre-ordered the new Ratchet and Clank Hollow game. The what? You know, the game based on that incident with you and that Lombax. Oh, you must mean the Hollow film. Yeah, it's pretty good. If you like all CG. No, I mean the game. It's based on the Hollow film. Look, here's my confirmation email. I'm having it mag shipped to prison. <laughs> They're making a game based on the Hollow film based on my life? But they haven't even consulted me. Oh, this is my fault. I've been away from my adoring public in this forsaken place too long. And now, no one will ever hear my side. I'd like to hear your side, Captain. You would? Well, then sit down, wary criminal, and I'll tell you a story. It all started with a hapless Lombax named Ratchet. <laughs> Think you're gone. Hey, Grim, you're here. I I thought you'd be down at the bazaar shopping for gravity coils. Uh huh. Well, I'm here. I'm always here. I don't suppose you sneaking out would have anything to do with those Galactic Ranger tryouts? I just need one hour. Come on, Grim. These are the Galactic Rangers we're talking about. Captain Quark will be there. No leaving the garage until you help fix Mr. Micron's ship. Now get on that bolt crank. Does that ship look mag-lifted to you? Get on that bolt crank, come on! Look at this thing. Avionics fried, CPU fried, even the gosh darn gravity coils fried! Oh, you really did a number this time, kid. Okay, let's see if these new Versa bulbs work. Look up, do you see something flashing? Yep, left side looks good. It's a miracle. Onto the afterburner lights. Look down. You see? Lower left afterburner light checks out. This thing might just be space worthy after all. One more to the right. Lower right afterburner works. So, are we good? Yep, we're good. The news says the tryouts are being held at the fairgrounds. Show them what you got, kid. And so Ratchet began his adventure, hoping to become a galactic ranger. Ratchet bashed his enemies using his trusty Omni Wrench. <laughs> In order to best his foes, Ratchet used the warrior's time honored tradition of jumping. <laughs> Ratchet.
Sergeant knew he faced mortal peril. Should he find himself on the verge of death, he'd need to find nanotech to heal. <laughs> I used that stuff after a bank robbery once. It healed, like, three out of five gunshot wounds. <laughs> Displayed a flagrant disregard for public property. Look at him smashing crates. <laughs> the hubris. Maybe he was just saving up bulk so he could buy a new weapon to protect the galaxy. Then. Hey, who's telling the story here? is a perilous place, as evidenced by the large amounts of ammunition left sitting around in crates. things up. We've armed these dummies with Gadgetron flamethrowers. Our lawyers are totally cool. Good job, recruits. You may just be the next Galactic Ranger. Head to the final challenge. Come on, Ratchet. You can do this. It's time for the final challenge. Survive a brutal onslaught of enemies, and you just might be our next Galactic Ranger. Or Whoa, looks like some angry toes. Another one that impressive. Could we be looking at Solana's next galactic ranger? to the show. Huh. That wasn't so bad.
Atlas defect knew that his best chance for survival lay with the facility's ventilation system. If he could just run to the vent, he might just make it out of there alive. I know you will find the defect, Victor. You never disappoint. Feeble Defect knew that if he were to survive, he would have to throw a bomb at whatever lay in his path. The young Defect spotted a spring bot ahead of him, and knew that with this handy device in his arsenal, he could now defeat the deadliest of forces, gravity. You're running, you useless piece of scrap! Get back here and let's settle this! Warbot to Warbot! Oh no! Water! <laughs> Piece of scrap! Get back here and let's settle this! Warbot to Warbot! Oh no! Water! was a little close for my liking. Suddenly, the defect spotted a power bot. This device could power up a variety of machines, but where should he throw it? <laughs> You're like really good at adding drama, man. Thank you, Shiv. I pride myself on my pension for storytelling. What seems to be the problem, Victor? You won't get away from me, Chairman. I've got him right where I want him. Suddenly, the defect spotted a power bot. This device could power up a variety of machines, but where should he throw it? <laughs> You're like really good at adding drama, man. Thank you, Shiv. I pride myself on my penchant for storytelling. What seems to be the problem, Victor? You won't get away from me, Chairman. I've got him right where I want him. Think you can run from me? Not that brute again.
think you can run from me? Not that brute again. Get back here, you miserable defect! Try out running this! I'm gonna rip you apart, sprocket by sprocket! Thoughts race through Ratchet's head. Could he repair this diminutive war bot? <laughs> Would it be the key to the adventure he craved? Did he leave the proto engine on in the garage? The answer to all these questions was yes. All right, hang on. I'll get us back. <laughs> to the garage.